Will this development slow down? I don't think so. In fact, rather the reverse. We can also anticipate advancements in the next 10 years that we can't even fathom now. Here are 8 innovations that could influence how we live in the future. Hello guys and welcome back to our channel, Tech Studio. A captivating video on the amazing changes that upcoming inventions will bring is what we have in hand for you today. So let's get going. Number 1. The G-Fi Similar to a MiFi or other similar equipment, G-Fi is a portable device that transforms a 4G phone connection into a Wi-Fi hotspot. However, it does have a few features that set it apart from the typical dongle and make it more interesting. The fact that it functions in about 100 different countries and will soon expand to be even more should save tourists from having to spend time and effort looking for and using local services or paying exorbitant roaming fees. Second, you don't need to rush things and risk making costly mistakes because limitless bandwidth costs $9.99 per 24 hours. Third, if your G-Fi still has power, then you can use it to recharge a smartphone. Fourth, you can use it as an internet backup device around the office. And now for another intriguing concept, number two, wireless electricity. The transmission of electrical energy without the use of wires is what's referred to as wireless electricity. People frequently draw parallels between the wireless transmission of information, such as radio, cell phones, or Wi-Fi internet, and the wireless transmission of electrical energy. The main distinction is that the technology for radio and microwave broadcasts concentrates on recovering just the information, not all of the energy that was originally transferred. Being close to or at 100% efficiency is ideal when dealing with energy transport. Although it's still a relatively new field of technology, wireless electricity is growing quickly. You may already be utilizing this technology without realizing it, such as with a cordless electric toothbrush that recharges in a cradle or the newest cell phone charger pads. The toothbrush rests in the charging cradle and the phone rests on the charging pad. Thus, even though they're both theoretically wireless, they don't travel any great distance. The difficulty has been in coming up with strategies for effectively and securely transporting energy across a distance. Number 3. Autonomous Vehicles a vehicle that can sense its surroundings and function without human intervention is an autonomous vehicle. There's no requirement for a human passenger to operate the car at any moment or even to be inside the vehicle at all. An autonomous vehicle can go anywhere a traditional vehicle can go and can perform any task that a skilled human driver can. In order to run the software, autonomous automobiles need sensors, actuators, sophisticated algorithms, machine learning systems, and potent CPUs. Based on a number of sensors positioned throughout the vehicle, autonomous automobiles build and update a map of their surroundings. Radar sensors keep track of the whereabouts of adjacent automobiles. Traffic lights, road signs, other vehicles and pedestrians are all detected by video cameras. LiDAR, or light detection and ranging sensors, estimate distances, find road boundaries, and recognize lane markers by reflecting light pulses off of the environment around the car. When parking, ultrasonic sensors on the wheels pick up on the curbs and other cars. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe to Tech Studio if you haven't already. And to enable those post alerts, tap that bell symbol. Now let's move back onto the video. Number 4. The Human Microchip From the smartphones in our hands, to the smartwatches on our wrists, to the earbuds in our ears, technology is blending more and more with our bodies. With a small microchip, it's now practically getting under our skin. A human microchip implant is often an RFID or Radio Frequency Identification Transponder or Identifying Integrated Circuit device that's placed inside of the human body and covered in silicate glass. This kind of subdermal implant typically includes a special ID number that can be used to connect data from an external database, including contact details, personal identification, law enforcement, medical history, prescriptions, and allergies. Numerous people in Sweden have had microchips implanted in their hands. Accessing users' homes, workplaces, and gyms is as simple as swiping their hands across a digital reader, which is now quickly and how conveniently these chips are intended to speed up daily routines for users. In addition, emergency contact information, social media profiles, and even e-tickets for events and train trips can all be stored on these chips. The use of the chips is an extension of the idea of the Internet of Things, or IoT, which is a universe of connected things that will have over 30 billion connected devices by the end of 2020 and 75 billion devices by 2025. Knowing this will help you understand the big picture of this technology. Number 5. Robotics 
The area of engineering known as robotics is concerned with the creation, design, building, use and application of robots. A robot is described as an automatically operated machine that performs a series of activities independently and completes tasks that are typically completed by humans. Robots don't necessarily look like people, though some do. For evidence, look at pictures of the vehicle manufacturing lines. Androids are often used to describe robots that mimic human characteristics. It's not always the case, even though robot designers try to make their inventions look human so that people feel more comfortable around them. Some people find robots unsettling, particularly those that resemble people. Artificial intelligence, or AI, improves collaboration possibilities, the quality, and human-robot interaction. Cobots, which are robots that do testing and assembly alongside people, are already used in the industrial sector. Robots were initially developed to replicate human behavior, and AI advancements make this way easier. Robots that behave and think like people may be more adaptable in the workplace and more efficient than human workers. Number 6. Printed Food A meal made using an automated additive technique is referred to as 3D printed food. Consider the pizza vending machines that appeared back in 2015. This concept may seem rather vague, and it is. Within the same machine, the dough is prepared, extruded, topped with tomato sauce and cheese, and then baked. In a sense, this procedure might be viewed as a simple 3D printing food procedure. In 2023, there will be an upscale 3D printing restaurant and a large number of food printers on the market. Many believe that, given the current state of technology and public interest, every household kitchen will soon be fitted with a food 3D printer. In actuality, the adoption of 3D printed food by experts and consumers is still in its infancy and still has a long way to go. This does not, however, prevent us from being in awe of these fantastic devices and their fascinating culinary patterns. The processes that can be used to 3D print food are limited. By far the most popular method for 3D printing food is material extrusion, which, like fused deposition modeling or FDM printing, calls for paste-like ingredients like purees, mousses, and other viscous foods like chocolate ganache. Number 7. The Hyperloop Unprecedented in terms of transportation, Tesla founded and developed the Hyperloop concept. For more information, let me clarify that it's a high-speed propulsion system contained in a dome-like structure that enables the system to engage and move through a vacuum. In comparison to oxygen, the speed of transportation is high in a vacuum. Tesla is now doing a technical evaluation of its innovative idea and developing partnerships for its access across cities. Future predictions predict that Hyperloop will expand into a worldwide transportation network and alter how people view travel. Supporters claim that the Hyperloop may be more affordable, quicker, and less polluting than air travel, trains, and automobiles. They assert that it takes less time and costs less money to build than conventional high-speed rails. Therefore, the Hyperloop could be used to relieve traffic congestion on congested roads, facilitating travel between cities and possibly generating significant economic benefits as a result. And at number 8, Bionic Eyes A bionic eye is an electronic prosthesis that's surgically inserted into a human eye to enable light transduction or the conversion of environmental light into brain-processable signals in individuals who have suffered a serious retinal loss. The cochlear implants that used to help persons with hearing loss hear again are sometimes compared to bionic eye implants. The development of bionic eye technology is still in its infancy. Different lenses and other options are becoming available in 2022 and beyond as scientists continue to investigate bionic eyes and technological advances. Future research in this area might lead to bionic eye options for a variety of causes of vision loss. Given the novelty of this technology, there are numerous potential routes for bionic eyes. For the time being, understanding what's already available and some prospective improvements will help you get a better idea of how bionic eyes can benefit people in the future. Some of these inventions may be ones that you're familiar with. Which one did you like better? Do you consider it to be a remarkable change for the future? Your comments are welcome down below. Also, feel free to like and subscribe to this video. View additional videos on our YouTube channel, Tech Studio. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.